Hello everyone, it's good to see your faces again. My name's Sam, welcome back to my channel, Catching Cosmos, and this is our Minecraft 1.19 survival world. Now, you might be wondering where I am. I am standing on top of uh, this little coal pillar because I thought it might be fun to fortune some coal that I got before I lost all of my things and also use this as a way to have a bit of a look around the world and you can see what we've done so far so there's our little starter house at the back we've got our storage building with the storage down below our barn with our cows and sheep we've got some alpacas over there we've also got our fields and our lovely windmill alpacas I think these are llamas my bad they're definitely llamas and we're kind of getting overrun now let's grab this coal and then we'll get started on today's episode. Honestly, not heaps, but it'll do. You might remember that at the end of the last episode, I died. So we lost pretty much all of our good stuff. Uh, we lost a really good pick, the Silk Touch pick, but we still luckily have this Fortune 3, Efficiency 4, Unbreaking 3 pick, which will come in handy. I have a random... Nope, that's not the way I want to face. There we go. It's been a hot second since I've done this. I've forgotten already. I'm wearing a random assortment of armor that I have gotten from our zombie farm, which we made uh, and which was the cause of our death. But today I just want to start off, to be honest, doing some mining to get us some diamonds again because we don't really have any anymore. Let's head down to the mines and while I'm mining, we'll have a little bit of a chat, I guess. All right, we are down in our little strip mine area. Uh, yes, no diamonds left behind. So I think we'll try and get, I don't know, as many diamonds as we can, or maybe I'll mine for like 20 minutes, but I don't know. We'll see how we go. I hope you have all been well. I'm so sorry that I sort of <laughs> vanished for a little bit. There are a few reasons for that, I guess, which we can talk about. One, I was a little burnt out from doing the uh, tutorial video that I did, which surprisingly took a really long time <laughs> doing everything through the replay mod and, you know, shooting things multiple times and getting the different angles and all of that sort of stuff. And then another thing was I just didn't really know what my next step would be. I mean, I have a whole list of ideas, but I just didn't really know where to start. And I guess I was also feeling a little bit discouraged because of the death. And the other is, is I just got busy in my life with work and... I guess socializing and things. I think I said this in the first episode, I don't mind taking things slow. It's not a race. And yeah, I think there's some joy in the simple, the simple slowness that you can get with Minecraft. I don't think you need to rush for everything. So hopefully you guys feel the same. Oh, diamonds. Okay, how many do we have? Just looks like two at the moment. Anything underneath three? Any more, any more? Oh, that is not what I wanted to hit. Okay, well, it looks like it could be five, which is good. Let's fortune this, see what we get please be good 12 that is pretty good okay we're off to a good start i think i want to get enough for a set of armor probably and some new tools and obviously we need some more for picks but yeah what have you all been up to in this little i think it's been about three weeks this three week break any exciting news have any of you been playing any new video games? I unfortunately have also been sucked into a couple of new games, one of them being Pokemon, which has its flaws, but also 
it's just so fun. And another game I have just started playing and I'm really interested in learning, but it's also very complex and it could be really fun to like post maybe a video or two on it is Dwarf Fortress. I've been enjoying those. That's pretty much all I've been playing besides tinkering with Minecraft. I've still been playing Minecraft. I've been trying to come up with builds and ideas for the world. I just haven't had the time to sort of sit down and record and all of that sort of stuff. Oh no. Uh, mm, okay. Well, that's not good. Uh, please stop. No lava, thank you. Okay, I just have to remember that oh, there is lava. But I want to go that way. That is where my <laughs> uh, This place is out to get me, for sure. I honestly think that we might have to find somewhere else to start a strip mine because between the lava and all of the skulk, I'm really not getting anywhere. Oh, why? Why is there so much lava? Ah, ha! Diamonds. Just in time. All right, how many are there? Is it just one? Why is it just one? Okay, it's at least two. Uh, oh, uh, oh, mm, mm. Does that mean they're gonna burn? Okay. If I do that... Oh god, don't... Ugh. That is stressful. Okay, so we got eight from... I didn't even know what it was for. So that's not too bad. We're making progress. Uh, let's see if we can... Oh, well that's good. I'm out of torches. One second. Well, this is lucky. I mean, I don't know how many of the V. One. Two, just two, three, thank you. Any more, any more, four. Wait, are they, oh my God, five, six, seven. Uh, no, 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 no. Thank you. Okay, we got 35 from that. I think we'll call that a day. I think we've pushed our luck a fair bit, but that's enough lava scarce for today. Let's head back to the surface and do something with some of our diamonds and then we'll get started on today's project. We've got a few diamonds to our name. So let's see, and we do actually have 31 levels. What can I get on this pick? Efficiency 4. Hmm. About. Let's make a chest plate, some pants, shoes. I don't know if you can hear that ambulance going past. Or is it a fire truck? Oh, someone is dying. Not in whatever emergency services vehicle that's going past. Uh, a carrot. Thank you. Now let's see if any of this is good. Protection 4 would be good. Breaking three. Protection for on the booties. Fire protection on the helmet. Uh, I still really kind of want to get silk touch, so let's just try this and see what happens. Another fortune three. Why have I gotten so many fortune three pickaxes in this game? Let's try one more time just to see what we get. And then maybe we can chuck some low level stuff on the fortune three again. What is this? This is kind of wild. I don't, 
is coming up so often. Let's get that. And each time we'll check efficiency for. Nope. Fire protection. Thank you. Efficiency four again. No, thank you. Protection one. Fortune again. Honestly, kind of cursed. I'm breaking three. There is silk touch. Oh, you know what? I could do that. Can I do that and combine it? No, I think that's kind of silly, isn't it? I'll leave it for now. You guys tell me whether that's a good deal or not on the fortune. I'm not on the fortune, on the silk touch. I'm losing my mind. It's late. There we go. Full diamond armor. I think it's time, to be honest. And we look really good. I'm pleased. We obviously need better enchants than these on it, but. Like, we're not out doing anything crazy, so I think we'll be fine. Today, I wanted to do something involving redstone, which is not something I really touch a whole lot. Kind of intimidating, I'm not gonna lie. Very confusing. We're going to make an automated sugarcane farm. And it's probably gonna be very uh, poor performing. Uh, but regardless, that is what I want to do today. Now the first thing I want to do is build two chests. And do I have... I don't have everything that I need, but for now I'm just going to put the chests... And I think we'll build here. I think here should be fine. Let's put one chest... There and there, and then our hopper goes into the chest. Look, I know it's not amazing, but <laughs> this is the start, and I'm sort of doing this from memory, so, but it's a pretty simple design, one that's been, I've seen people do many times, countless times over. Okay, I think I have everything that I need. Sorry, I'm all over the place. Uh, hopefully this is making sense. I'm sure it will. I want to make powered rails as well. Good. It's plenty. Of course, it's getting late. Two, three, four. Up here. We will put these guys along here. That goes there. Oh. I need to put this here. Oh no. What have I done? Is that gonna... Okay. It's working. I'm just gonna go sleep. Now, if I was sensible, I probably could have done... I mean, built the structure first and then built the farm. But when I was coming up with this design, I built the house structure first. And then I built this. And it was incredibly difficult. So... I am trying it the other way around. Hopefully it is not too difficult to sort of build everything. Now this is where our sugar cane is going to go. And this should hold the water. There we go, there we go. There we go. Now, this is always a struggle for me. Nope, that did not work. There we go. And there's that. I think that that's it. So if I put some sugar cane as if it is growing, there we go. This is, some of you are probably laughing at this right now, but it's a farm. And it will hopefully make some paper for us. And if we need to, we can make a bigger one later on. So I'm just going to dump some things and then get what I need. And then come back and we will build our little 
house structure to cover up our ugly farm. Okay, so I think I have the basics about what we're going to need. I'm just going to grab one more, uh, excuse me. <laughs> Why are you on my roof? Why? I don't really need more llamas. Anything? Absolutely nothing. Uh, but I will take your leads. Thank you. Oh, sorry. You and you. Let's go. Farewell, Mr. Trader. No, oh, now you're gonna follow me back. Okay, whatever. There you go. Welcome to the club. Hi, B. As I was saying, I think I've got most of what I need to build this little structure. House cover-up thing and I've already set down two blocks just so I can get my bearings okay with the llama sorted let's build this house Here you go. I have built a cute little house to hide our sugarcane farm. Now, oh, it might actually go off at any second. Let's sit and watch for a second. Ah, oh, there we go. It did it. And hopefully everything has been absorbed. Let's see. There we go. We've got 13 sugarcane, so it is working. Uh, it's very cramped down here. I thought that out the back here, we could create a little pen for all of the llamas that we've collected. We do it like that, 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 there, 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 there. Of course it's raining. Uh, we will put those so that they cannot escape. I don't think they can escape. Okay, so we have a little llama pen. It's pretty cute if I do say so myself going to open these up because there is something that I've always wanted to try and I'm hoping that it will work but maybe it will not but I think if you lead one llama with a lead the rest will hopefully follow so let's grab you oh wait first I need to get everybody off my bad Everybody off, everybody off. Okay. Do I have... I have this guy. Now, if I pull... Hopefully the others will follow. Okay, we got four of them. Well, four is better than none, I guess. <laughs> Why do you not want to come in? Come on. Come on. Well... 
second option is lure them in with the hay. All right, come on, everybody in. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Come on, come on, come on. Are you serious? There we go. We have our little llama pen. Now at some stage, I'm going to go through and give them all a nice little color. We've got a couple already, but I think with this build, let's just have a bit of a look over here, see what it looks like from this end. Not bad, not bad. And then we go in. We can see our alpacas, alpacas. We can see our llamas. I am just going to keep saying alpacas, aren't I? And then hopefully over time, we will get some sugar cane. I'm also gonna have to connect this path up, make things look a little bit prettier, but I think for today, we're gonna call it there. Hopefully you didn't mind, I guess the little rambly, talky bit at the start. Uh, hopefully it means you get to know me a little bit better and the games that I like and all of that sort of stuff. And you know, we'll see how uh, productive this farm is. And I hope you enjoyed the build. And I'm glad we have finally sort of tucked our llamas away for now because they were getting a little bit all over the place but i think but that's it thank you so much for watching my name's sam this channel is catching cosmos please be kind to yourselves and i will see you in the next one bye